Everybody, we are right here at the Ubisoft offices in San Francisco, and I am currently joined by Frédéric Lefrancois from Ubisoft Montreal, who's here to tell us a little bit about Assassin's Creed Bloodlines for the PSP. So let's get right to the obvious question. Uh, Assassin's Creed 1, not to spoil anything, sort of ended on a little bit of a cliffhanger. So in terms of a story, where does Assassin's Creed Bloodlines fit into it? Yeah, so Assassin's Creed Bloodlines uh, picks up right after the events of the original one. So you get to play Altair. So what happens is that right after the death of Robert Dessard, uh, the Templars, uh, led by Armand Bouchard, they fled the Holy Land to go on the uh, Cypress Island. So there you'll have Altair uh, hunting the Templars down. So it will join the local resistance in order to get rid of the, uh, the Templar commander and just to uh, fight back the uh, Templars' occupation. Now, is uh, Altair in this game, is he just as powerful as when he finished off Assassin's Creed 1, or is he in trouble with the uh, Assassin's Guild again? Does he have to earn his swords back, his powers? Yeah, so no. Uh, the uh, Altair that you'll, uh, you'll have in uh, Bloodlines will be uh, really a master, so he's no longer bound by the uh, leadership of Almanim, so right from the start he'll have all his weapon. How does it control this time around? What are the big differences um, for Assassin's Creed on the PSP in terms of uh, how the game is working? Yeah, so uh, I think we did a very good job at uh, integrating all of the fundamental elements of the uh, of the brand. So in terms of control, uh, we have that same smooth control that was uh, familiar on the home console. So we've been able to map uh, to have that same control mapping. And what's interesting for the players is that they'll be able to experience that same freedom of movement that they had on the original. The uh, open world is uh, really a key element of the brand, so we are very pleased that we've been able to translate that experience. So this time around, Altair will uh, get to explore two large cities, so you'll definitely get the same freedom experience, and you'll have to uh, explore those cities. You'll be free run, sprint, all the all of the moves that were, uh, you know, uh, the were signature move of Altair in the original. Everything uh, got uh, made its way uh, into the game. And the Animus system, you were telling me that's still a very big part, right? Yes, the Animus is still very useful in order to live your uh, past ancestors' memory, so this will definitely be part of Bloodlines. Frederick, sounds really good. Uh, before I let you go, can you tell us when is Bloodlines going to be available in stores, and is it a PSP exclusive? Yes, it is definitely a PSP exclusive, and uh, you'll be able to play it holiday 2009. Thank you very much. My pleasure. All right, there you go. Assassin's Creed Bloodlines coming holiday 2009 to the PSP.